So the natural surrealism pieces I create out in nature where I've been on hikes or swimming or um, just sitting outside taking in the beauty of nature. So I have all of these visual cues, all these gifts really, these visual gifts, a, a flower, a wave, a leaf, an animal, um, movement of leaves and trees. And then when we talk about the mystical realism pieces, it's almost like uh, the opposite. It's, it's a completely different approach. I could be painting in the darkness. And really, actually, when I create these pieces, it is like I'm painting in the dark. I'm in a, usually a very dark place, and there's only one little lamp, and I have no visual cues. And it's a very internal and very quiet place that these pieces come from. They actually emerge out of the darkness without visual cues. I usually have no idea what I'm painting. In, in a way, I'm painting blind. Uh, the, the brush touches the canvas, and I have no idea where it's going. And often, I'll, I'll start to create forms, and I still don't know what they are until the piece is done. Uh, so these pieces are really created out of the darkness and out of the formless. And in this way, I'm really trying to go deeply within to give the formless form in the real world. And a lot of times, these I have themes about how we travel into the darkness within our own lives when we allow ourselves to relax into the shadows so that we can illuminate our own shadows and bring them to light because they're within all of us. And we tend to run away from them, but really they're, they're a part of us that need to be explored and illuminated. And so these, these pieces I really feel are uh, companions on that path, on that interior journey in the inner world to go and explore the shadows and the dark corners and the recesses and then bring them to light and so that there can be uh, an opportunity for transformation and change and metamorphosis. And that's why often in these pieces you'll see things that are like cocoons or a, like a chrysalis uh, where again it mimics this process of going deep within and creating a cocoon around oneself. Uh, to allow a change and metamorphosis to occur. And then again, another cycle of rebirth and emerging as a butterfly over and over again in our lives.